welcome back. It's now day 109. And I haven't checked out swimming yet, so we're gonna gonna take a dive into that. Hey, Infinity. Happy Sunday. Good morning, everyone. <clears throat> right now it's 9.04 a.m. on Sunday. Ooh, Nook Inc. has been exploring and studying the water surrounding our island. Please announce that based on the findings, the ocean's been deemed safe for swimming. What's more, the water itself is clear and clean, which are perfect conditions for underwater diving. <clears throat> for everyone's safety, we ask that you please use proper swimwear if you plan to enter the water. You can purchase a wetsuit at either the shop or in Nook Shop. Neat. Oh, you must have all 40 creatures. Nice. All right, let's see. Oh, we have some stuff here. The Bank of Nook again. Ah, 2,000 bells, big money. I'm writing to you because we get along so well. Also, I wanted to tell you that I value open and honest communication. So please, if anything ever comes to mind, feel free to talk to me, I'm here for you. It's Whitney. What Nintendo send us? Ah, some new seasonal offerings in the shopping center. Let's let's change our clothes. Let's see. What do I have here? Ah, right. I can be a peasant. Oh, I have snorkel, snorkel mask. Alright, okay, so let's go look for a DIY. Oh, somebody just dropped a bunch of their stuff here before, I guess. Huh. Alright. Oh, Stitches is wearing his crown and the outfit. A million dollar crown I bought him that he barely, barely ever wears. Blend, where have you been for the last two weeks? Everyone's been worried about where you were. Happy to see you again. You should say hi to everyone, then we can hang out. It's been a while since I've logged into Animal Crossing. Alright, let's see. Somebody should be crafting. Yeah, they planned for three years from what I've heard. Three years of updates. Bund, you were away for a spell, weren't you? I confess, I was getting a wee bit worried, but you seem fine as frog's hair. Fine as frog's hair. Huh. I'm so sorry, as you grossed to my crafting project. Alright, what are you making? A bamboo lunchbox. Hey, I'm gonna open up. I'm gonna open up my island here soon. I just need to find my DIY on the beach. Then after I find my DIY, I'll open up my island. Hey, 
Oh, we have Dopey. <laughs> Dopey and she. I hadn't spoken to you in a while. It seems I was worried that Dunn scared you off. Well, I know you got your own affairs to attend to, so I'll let you get to it. Good to see you. What does Dopey have to say? Now there's a sight for bad eyes. <laughs> That's an interesting saying. Blend, how are you doing? Been up to anything crazy? I hope so. Just as long as you took care of yourself as you did it. You only get one body, kiddo. Don't wreck it. Alright, words of advice from Dobie. Yeah, mainly I just want to get the DIY. Oh wow, this is actually kind of this is going off my my weed hill here. Still no giant flower though. There's a DIY. I still haven't seen uh, the turnip lady. Good old Daisy May. Oh, there's Daisy. Alright, let's see. What's our price? 96 bells. Sorry, let me update that. Uh, edit. 96. Alright, so that should work. Let's see, exclamation. Turn up. I think. Yeah. Alright, so now let's see... Let's stop our wheel. Ah, oh, black. <laughs> oh, that's the fancy ring box. Let's check this out. And a cacao tree gas station pump. Oh yeah, and the wetsuit we have to buy from here. That's an interesting net. Put on your wetsuit. Just press A by the beach. Alright. No, 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 no. <laughs> Alright, so let's see... <laughs> I like how Dobie's just running around. Alright, so there's some more stuff in the shopping. Oh, that doesn't even look like a wetsuit. Looks like a sweater. Huh. Some bamboo grass? Interesting. Don't mind if I do. Yeah, the person I'm moving out next is Julia. Whenever they decide to move out. 
Oh, I should see if there's anything in the recycling, actually. the last thing. Sports tank. And I have too much stuff. Modeling clay? That's actually new. Nice. Uh, let's put some money away. Yeah, once, yeah, whenever Julia moves out, I'll just, uh, if, if you want Julia, feel free. Last person who took Piper reset their island. <laughs> so Piper entered the void. Alright, so we did that, we did that. Uh, yeah, I guess it's, uh, time to open up the island. Ah, that's fine. Thanks for thanks for tuning in, Noah. All right. Be a dodo code. All right, here we go. Dodo code seven K two EK. Then let's update Nightbot with that. Edit. Blooks from Blookstown. Some overstuffed lawn clippings. Came prepared with their wetsuit.
Oh, we have Aiden from Delta Isle. Shady Life Hacker. Hey, Courtney. How are you doing this Sunday? Zapida from Golden Wind. We didn't even check our uh, Able sister to see what clothes are for sale. Alright, let's put some of this stuff away. I heard this was like a small, smallish update. Interesting to see what uh, August will bring. Very first island dweller William from Sun Isle. Sun Island. suit and some boots. Actually, it's kind of funny that you still have, like, boots on and whatnot. Like, technically, if you're wearing, like, the iron boots, wouldn't you just, like, stay sunk to the bottom? Alright, let's all 
tell us about. Oh, bubbles. Nails to ya. <laughs> You're in the thumbnail. Oh, you have a gift. Ah, okay. Coming back. Yeah, that's a huge crab. Is that thing you can get from dive? I guess that would be from diving. Huh. Can you make models of this then, I guess? With, uh... With, like, flick or whatever? Because that'd be cool if you can get, like, a giant crab model or something for CJ whoa got an acorn barnacle I just like swimming underwater you know That's <laughs> oh, the crab is placeable like the snapping turtle? Ah, nice. That's cool then. Ah, back to shore. Yeah, I want a giant crab. <laughs> oh, that's the gold helmet. Ah. Where's that? Sweet. So is there like some insane like shadow you need to look for for the crab or is it just like randomly from like diving? Like, just, oh, you found a crab. You're, st you're stuck underwater, doesn't that mean that you're drowning? After seeing that crab, I want to catch a giant crab. <laughs> Your game won't let you move. Huh. 
Are you like trapped underneath a dock or something? Whoa, that that shadow right there in the in the water actually almost looks like that's like a giant giant sea creature or something, but it's just rocks. Ah, well, yeah, you can always do the what is it? The minus button, right? The minus button, and just leave that way, and that'll do it properly. If you are stuck. Looks just drowning, I'm just catching some sea creatures. Yeah. What do you do? Do you like go here and then there must be some sort of sequence of events. Yeah, I can't I can't take my phone out underwater. Yeah, if, if somebody quietly leaves. Like you can still leave through the minus button though. Just as long as people aren't like in an interaction, you should just allow them to leave properly. I'm dead. <laughs> oh, we got something different. Whoa. This is. I got an octopus. I can give it four hugs, at, or I can give four hugs at once. Oh, all my stuff is full. I need to go back to shore. Yeah, swimming's alright though. I don't mind it. it. Gives you more options of stuff to do. Hey, how's it going? Shouldn't you be entertaining your company from off island? Oh, and you're going to introduce yours truly, aren't you? I'll be on my best behavior, I promise. Oh, you're in the place where you gave me the swimsuit. All right, let's go have a look. Sea grapes. That means you should be pretty much right down here. Duck underwater. <laughs> the dangers of swimming in the sea, you know. You just never know when you're going to get stuck. Oh, you only get the spider crab in March and April. 
아. Ah, so we still have all of this. That means there's a good chance. Yeah, we still have the DIY. Nice. Let's go unload our stuff again. Does the sea creatures count as something towards the timer thing? Like when you set the timer to have like the competitions? Let's actually test that actually. Let me get my timer back out. Oh yeah, there's actually a separate sea creature thing. Oh, if there's a separate sea creature, does that mean there's actually gonna be like a competition for, for like in the sea then? There's gonna be some other creature similar to, uh, who is it? The CJ and Flip? a lot of seed grapes. Whoa, got a muscle. It's been working out. There's also a lot of wealth. Yeah, it's just neat that you can actually like, use the rest of your island here though. I'm guessing an otter will probably show up in the town square for the sea competition if there if there is one at least. It could make sense considering that you use the timer and it pops up. I got a sea star. Maybe it'll give me an autograph.
Whoa, this is a sea urchin. I wasn't even urchin for it. <laughs> oh, this is new. This is... We got a moon jellyfish. Now I just need to find a sun peanut butter fish. <laughs> Such lame puns they have. I just killed my hand because I touched a jellyfish. Or this. I guess the sea urchin would also kill my hands. What's that island off in the distance? Can you swim to it? <laughs> now that would be interesting if you can actually like, swim to a different island altogether. Another well. Yeah, we can do the wheel. Definitely do the wheel. Swim up to my secret shore here. Oh, we got another octopus. Drop off some stuff, and then yeah, we can do the wheel. So the way the, the way the wheel works is oh, there's some more stuff here. Huh. Clumps of weeds, some sort of fossil that I probably dropped somewhere and something picked up. <laughs> but yeah, spin the wheel. Black you lose, red you win. Started a thousand, double or nothing. Ah, books got to go. Ah, that's fine. Do what you gotta do. Thanks, thanks for showing up. So we only got one jellyfish. So the jellyfish is probably probably a rare species. For sale at the Able Sister. Oh, 
Oh, right, you can't do it under a transformation. Oh, you can't use it with the wetsuit on. Ah, huh. Oh, somebody's having a conversation with someone else or some interaction. Honestly, leaving that way isn't really that bad. Because it does do like the countdown and everything, and. Yeah, if people. If people are doing something and they don't want to get quietly. Somebody. If they don't want somebody to quietly leave, then they just stop doing what they're doing in those uh, 10 seconds. I have all this stuff on me still. Well, this actually got reset quite a ways away because I don't even have the. Um. The whatchamacallit? The jellyfish. So because he quietly left, I actually reset it quite a ways back. Huh. I'm on my way. Just need to drop my stuff off again. Alright, so I updated the description again just so I have an easy reference. Uh, so. Spin the wheel, red you win, black you lose. First time you win, it's at a thousand. So far, we've only had one contestant win the 99,000. <gasps> That's red. Definitely red. Alright, so you can choose to take it. Oh, they're going for the double. Going for the 2,000. So now they can choose. Oh, they're going for the double again. Oh, that's black. of lesser sanity. How are you doing today? Alright, 
back to see what's in the evil shop. Ah, 2 a.m. wishing. So is that a time travel 2 a.m. wishing or is it actually like 2 a.m. where you're at? If it's 2 a.m. where you're at, you're, you're up pretty late. It's either that or you're a night owl, which also I know a few people like that. Oh, a jockey helmet. Hmm. It's the southern life. Well, oh, thanks for tuning in, person, person of lesser sanity. chat to some of our villagers since we haven't been on for for a couple weeks or a week or so yeah feel free to share your code honestly it's, it's completely fine oh hashtag it's been a while hasn't it just so you know i'm still the same old text the fame hasn't gone to my head yet <laughs> Alright, you got my attention. What's up, Kante? Hang on. Don't you have someone coming to visit? Should I come help you show off far away? You know, like an ambassador? Oh yeah, and all this stuff is still here too. After we cleaned it up. My jet setter. It's been a while, hasn't it? Oh, I know how you are. You always keep yourself so busy. Just be sure to take some you time. Hey, you've got company from another island today. Oh, this feels great to see new faces. How many people are even on my island right now? Oh, we got two. We got Aiden and we got William. A Daisy May. Good old Daisy May. Alright, so I think we can go try and find our jellyfish again. I guess we probably should drop off our inventory. Swimming's kind of neat. It would be nice if there was like a little bit more to the update. Yeah, 
anyone else in the chat? Yeah, there's a few people in the chat, I think. Catch in uh, from swimming on the southern hemisphere. Are they AFK? Because it, it did reset, so if, if somebody was AFK. But you can still leap through the minus, though. Like, you can use the minus button and leave. Red King Crab. Ooh. Hmm. Maybe we should go check out check out a southern hemisphere island. Since you showed up to the chat and you offered the Southern Hemisphere adventure, yeah, let's go check it out. Let's really drop off some stuff though. A giant crab. It'll seem kind of neat if you can place them. And you know what? I'm gonna give you some blue roses because normally I'd give blue roses to people when I go visiting. Normally I used to do that on Saturdays, but Saturdays I think I'm gonna start continuing like playthroughs of games. So like do Shovel Knight on both, uh, or not Shovel Knight, Hollow, Hollow Knight first. Saturday and or Friday Saturday. Oh, you have blue roses. Ah, now I'll bring you one blue rose then. <laughs> See, I have a ton of blue roses. So we're going to end session. Yeah, we're going to go take a look at a southern island. Let's see if we can catch some cool stuff. Let's see, dodo code. Bring something warm. Uh, yeah, we should be fine. We got our wetsuit, right? Wetsuits are warm. Uh, let's 
visit someone. Oh, did the did the stars thing change already? Like, are you getting the the? Is there like a new new star that's new? Uh, what is it? The sign stars or whatever, like the Taurus. Has that changed yet? Ah, a long time no see, Carl. Oh, we're going to Satin Island. Definitely gives a new name to when hell freezes over, right? Considering so you said it's winter and whatnot. <laughs> Yeah, I haven't played Animal Crossing for like a week and a half or so. Or a week actually since the last time I started this. Oh, that's me. Yeah, it's me. Alright. Checking out swimming. Let's update the title here. a pretty nice island though. Oh you've been playing sword Carl. Nice. How you how you enjoying that? Did you just pick it up? Is it new to you or is it just the expansion? All these flowers. Let's see. I hope you don't mind. I'm just gonna plant you a blue rose and an orange rose. <laughs> yeah, because I need to free up my inventory <laughs> already. Okay, let's see what we can catch. I'm curious. Ah, you're completing the Pokedex. Nice. Yeah, that's always a task. I completed the main Pokedex for the shiny. Oh, you have bins. Ah, bins to toss stuff away. Got a sweet shrimp. It's very considerate. Oh, that's when you can- I guess this is a year- year-round thing is the sea star. Oh, and you can't actually release them. Can you release them if you go underwater? Oh, you can't open up your menu underwater. Oh, 
Ah, hey, Clara. Yeah, we're just visiting a southern hemisphere island. If you look up in chat, a uh, person of lesser sanity posted the thing. Ooh, a dungeon crab. Dun dun dungeness. <laughs> dun dun dungeness. <laughs> It'd be neat if you can actually swim just a tad bit faster. Like if you can tap A just a little bit faster and your guy would just like, I don't know, he would really like kick his feet. <laughs> oh, it's an octopus. So the octopus and sea star, those must be two year round things I'm guessing. Yeah, see the shadows are actually different sizes. Yeah. Uh, do I have the motion? Let's see. It's so cold. <laughs> Who goes swimming in the winter? Well, I guess some people do. Yeah. We've got two octopus. They're octopi, I guess. It's a little shellfish. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> yeah, Carl, if you ever need like a certain Pokemon to try to complete your decks, let me know. I think I might have all of them. At least I should. Cause I did, I did complete the shiny decks, but I did clear out some of my, my Pokemon boxes just because, yeah, with the new expansion, there's some new Pokemon to catch, and yeah. The Trapped Coconut. Oh, you live in the Southern Hemisphere. Ah. You're a cat swimmer. Yeah, I just want to see if I can catch like a, a big crab, like a giant king crab. That'd be kind of neat. Like, I wonder if there's certain spawns for them, like if they spawn in certain areas, like on the rocks, or if it's just all completely random. Whoa, this is got some seaweed. Couldn't kelp myself. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah, 
Yeah, I, f I figured that was the cat hat I gave you. Oh, what is this? Whoa, this is a sea slug. It's kind of salty about that. Huh. Help, Claire's. <laughs> now, this is a well designed place. Like, I always just look at the map and kind of see how many paths are made, and that really decides on, like, how much effort somebody's put in, I feel. Because, yeah, if you have a lot of paths and whatnot, and kind of areas you can go to, it's it's pretty neat, and it looks like an actual, like, town. Hey, Infinity. Oh, this is some big bubbles here. I think the size of the bubbles looks bigger. Attending to people. <laughs> the guide. Oh, that thing's big, I think, right? And it's moving around. Get back here. Get back here. <laughs> Let me swim a little faster. Oh my god. I can see why he said it takes 20 minutes to catch the thing. First thing I've s first thing that's actually tried to run away from me. Get back here. Get back here. Become my lunch. <laughs> Alright, I got you cornered. Yeah, nice. Whoa, this is kind of red king crab. It's royally flush. That's awesome. Caught a caught a crab. Caught the king crab. And yeah, you're right. That thing just that, that thing boogies away from you. Ah, oh, that thing's also moving. But it's probably gonna get reset. <laughs> Cause I think the animals move around after somebody leaves or comes back or shows up. But yeah, since it's saved though, that means I for surely at least have uh, the king crab though, which is kind of cool. JJ, the weak grandma from Fizzlin.
so in the south southern hemisphere right now is it actually like really cold so it's like probably in the minuses Yeah, and here, here in the northern hemisphere, it's super hot. <laughs> Claire is still stuck somewhere. Honestly, that's neat how you can clap in here and it actually like makes the little waves. It's a little attention to details that really makes Animal Crossing. Okay, I know where, where I grew up, it got anywhere from like minus 40 celsius to plus 40 celsius like throughout the whole year it was honestly pretty insane so yeah minus 40 you don't want to be there minus 40 oh it doesn't really happen that often anymore i don't think Register some cool uh, emotions. Let's see. Remove. in the water. <laughs> Honestly, it's kind of funny how you can just swim around with whatever headgear and feet gear that you want. Another Dungeness Crab. Dun dun Dungeness. You're gonna fish for <laughs> That's hilarious.
Oh look, they still have their DIY that they didn't pick up. Another octopus. I think that gives us uh, three. One, two, three. Yeah, so now we can make a model model octopus. Honestly, I have a feeling if you get three king crabs, it'll probably be a pretty big model. This thing's also taken off. All right. Oh, these things are hard to catch actually, oh my god. Is this it? Or did it run away? I got a sea pig. It's a sea pig. Kind of neat. That thing really boogied though. That was, that was crazy. So there's three things that move really. Get full body wetsuits. Oh, yeah, I don't have a full body wetsuit yet. Definitely a lot of these sea slugs. I wonder, can you release them once you get on the beach, maybe? Yeah, 
Yeah, that's a sea pig. Yeah, what's really common? This one's pretty common. Let's release our stars. I think, well, that's pretty common. Ha, he's trying to catch a catfish. <laughs> That's about it. Oh, this other thing. Acorn. It's also very common. Dungeonous. <laughs> Honestly, it's, it's actually kind of neat that there's creatures that run away from you and they're not just all just like just chilling there waiting for you to catch them. I guess things are moving slowly away. Got an al abalone. Why do I want a sandwich now? <laughs> Was big bologna, I guess. Abalone. Why uh, you want a sandwich? I guess there's some pretty big bubbles. Like, I think the bubble size kind of determines maybe what it is. Oh, just another slug. Yeah, who do you have on your island? It looks like the map app won't work while I'm swimming. Huh, interesting. Got a pearl oysters. Aw oh, shucks. Don't clam up now. And the way your island's actually laid out, looks like there's a lot of bodies of water. The fact that you can catch like super giant crabs kind of makes this worth it, right? But would it be cool if there was like a secret island though? Like one you can go to? Like maybe you dive and you find a cave or something? Can you get- oh actually yeah there might be a Spongebob reference. I can see that being a reference to Spongebob. Like some sort of uh, sponge creature. Oh, it's 
thing's kind of moving. Whoa, this is a mantis shrimp. Shrimply amazing. <laughs> Chop off finger. <laughs> oh, you got the sea thing too. Nice. It almost seems like if you want something super rare, you just kind of like go underwater and see if it tries to go away from you really fast. If it kind of just stays there, it's probably nothing neat. Oh, they're trying to catch a fish. Oh, you spooked it away with your swimming. <laughs> oh, we ran out of room of stuff. Yeah, I forgot you had stars. Shooting stars. Honestly, that's, that's cool how you can dive. Even though it says you have to go to like a beach where you can still just hop right in. Yeah, I'm happy actually I got that, uh, at least one king crab. It's kind of cool. Oh my god, you actually have like a graveyard. It's kind of neat. Oh, and you have a train tracks. Thank <laughs> you. 
That's actually a pretty cool lamp. Is that ah, I feel you yeah people who shake trees and they don't pick up after themselves so they pick up this peach for you help clean you will clean up your beach here all right all my stuff is full forgot about that so I'll eat this peach because I need energy and then here's the other apples I have no room for that. Let's see. Right. And check it out, you can also click the X button. The X button also really works for like looking behind stuff. That's generally, generally what I use, at least. Ooh, this one's kind of running away from me. Oh, we got another mantis shrimp. Nice. We can catch one more thing. are scallops. Scallops aren't really that cool. So we're not going to be like the other people who just drop our items on the beach. We're just going to release some stuff. Uh, sea slugs. That might be cool to keep. Uh, Alright, so we have room for one more. Blades. Oh, it's just some seaweed. I couldn't kill myself.
I don't think I have any more space, do I? No, I don't. Uh, let's see. We have two of these mantis shrimp now. Two of those. We have two Dungeness Crabs as well. Uh, oysters. Pearl Oyster. Oh, we have two of these oysters. Let's release one. So we have one more spot. Seaweed? Yeah, we don't really need to do it. Let's return some seaweed. Just throw that in there. <laughs> Alright, I made room for two more things. Feed me fish. <laughs> like, honestly, I wish you could release this stuff in the water. Like that's a big thing and it's not really like swimming away from me. So it's probably not anything really really exciting. I guess that's probably seaweed or something. Yeah, that's an abalone. Yeah. Abalone. I've learned the secret. You just gotta dive and hopefully it scurries away from you pretty fast. If it does, it's something living. That could be kinda neat. Yeah, we got our mantis shrimp in it. Nice. Oh, you don't even do a spin with this in the water. You just kinda shake your head. <laughs> hey, pint of games. How are you doing today, the Sunday? There's a lot they can do with swimming. Maybe on like some mystery islands or something they can do some swimming stuff. Mistakenly caught lawn clippings. Zack. From darkness. Yeah, I generally try to stream from uh, 9 a.m. to 11 a.m. my time. Generally Friday to Mondays. Yeah, I always want a new subscriber. If you enjoy the content, feel free to leave a like and subscribe. Definitely helps the channel out. So far we're doing a playthrough of Hollow Knight. We're probably going to continue that on Friday, Saturday. And then tomorrow we're going to do Mario Maker. Yeah, I am from the west coast of Canada. Canada's pretty nice. I like it. 
It seems to have the whole COVID thing kind of, at least somewhat under wraps. But there's still so many people that are like, oh my god, it's all a conspiracy theory. Don't believe anything you've said. Which is honestly pretty ridiculous. Man, yeah, another barnacle. Ah, you're from Ireland. How's how is it in Ireland? Yeah, you have people from all over the world. I love it. Yeah, the scary thing about the whole COVID issue is, is like, uh, is if you ever look into the 1918 Spanish flu pandemic, it was pretty much the same as uh, this COVID thing. The whole situational wise, at least. Uh, typically, I just I've been playing through games on Mon or Friday to Mondays. I used to do it daily. Then some internet stuff happened. I got sick, and yeah, currently Tuesdays to Thursdays. I just used to kind of rejuvenate. Recharge and whatnot. Yeah, we played through a few games on the channel, though. Played through Astral Chain and we played through Donkey Kong. Yeah, currently we're starting our playthrough of Hollow Knight, which I figure Friday, Saturdays I'll do playthroughs of, uh, of games. Our airports have no quarantines. Yeah, they don't. Yeah, actually, I started this started streaming regularly because of Animal Crossing. Like we used to do daily, daily Animal Crossing streams. This thing's kind of moving, it's slow. I think it's the best Switch game. Uh, honestly, that's a tough one. There's, uh, there's, there's so many good Switch games. It really depends on what you're into. Like, I can definitely see Animal Crossing being the best Switch game for some people. Then you have others where, uh, like platformers. They're all about the platformers. Honestly, the Switch has so many, so many good games on it. Ah, see you later, pint of games. Thanks for, thanks for tuning in for the subscription. Yeah, other than that, we're just like a chill, chill channel. I don't really swear at all. I feel like there's no real need to. I just saw a shooting star. I wonder, can you wish on stars in here? I guess not. Because A makes you swim. Oh, it's another shrimp. 
Uh, swap it. Let's swap it with the star. See, and that thing is not really moving. Moving a little bit. Oh! Dungeness crab, dun dun dungeness. <laughs> uh, swap a sea slug. That's. Yeah, we don't need these sea slugs. Whoa. Yeah, okay, Courtney. Yeah, I could probably check out your island here uh, at some point. Oh, this thing's swimming pretty fast. What are you? What are you? A lobster ran into you. Wow. Did you catch it? Oh, a snow crab. It's giving me the cold shoulder. Uh, let's release. What do we want to release? Like a sweet shrimp, a kind of see seaweed. We don't really need seaweed. Scallops. I think we can get scallops later. Mm. Yeah, let's release the scallop. Yeah, I think there are currently five people on the island. Maybe four. That's a big fish there. I don't want to spook it away. That thing's not really moving, so it's probably something small. Yeah, currently the dodo thinks actually it's probably not, it's probably different because this actually isn't my island, it's someone else's island. Oh, I did actually update that to visiting a southern island. Ah. Alright, cool. Well, thanks for having me. Yeah, Courtney, feel free to post your dodo dodo code in chat, and then yeah, I'll come come ch check out your island here before I end my stream, actually. And if you want some, if you want a blue rose, I can bring you a blue rose. Yeah, honestly, this island's actually pretty amazing. Like, for the fact they have, like, train tracks put down. Yeah, 
Yeah, it's so colorful too with all the flowers. Yeah, thanks. Thanks for having me over. I'm happy I actually caught caught some things. We didn't find a lobster, but we did find three different types of crabs. Oh, what? Why did... Did that actually... It shouldn't have crashed you guys' island. I hope not. Considering I was just leaving. Excited absolutely let's see, do I still Yeah. I hope that didn't crash it though. I said I just left. I didn't do anything special. There are some people I know that do actually crash islands, which honestly that's pretty horrible. Yeah, I've known some people, I think it's in the middle of traveling, they'll actually turn off their switch. If they turn off their switch, that forces a crash. It's the first time I've seen a crash happen from somebody just like standardly leaving. And leaving normally. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to leave. <laughs> <laughs> Man, some of that stuff they caught was pretty cool too. Like that one person caught a lobster? The sweet shrimp spends the first few years of its life as a male. Then it transitions into a female as it ages. Interestingly, it's hardly alone in this type of development cycle. Indeed, a great variety of marine creatures can change their biological sex as they age. Clownfish, some sea stars, and sea bass are among them. <laughs> Yeah, because it should have saved it a few times when that last person arrived. Which honestly, that's one reason why I kind of like when some people show up, because it basically forces that save. Which is that pretty good. Not given the king crab yet. Yes, 
It's everything except for the king crab. Next, we're gonna check out uh, Courtney's Island, right? Yeah, they're gonna open open their gates. That's the first time I caught this. That's huge. Caught an ocean sunfish. Good thing I'm wearing ocean sunscreen. <laughs> oh, okay, so that's the code. Okay, cool. Let's see. Oh, this thing's also in a pool. I like it. This crab's not actually out in the open. Alright, so let's go check out Courtney's Island to end the stream. Actually, let me let me bring you some keep bringing you a, a blue rose actually since I'm pretty sure there's some other people probably on their way there On my way. I just need to pick up, pick up my blue rose for you. See, I have so many blue roses now. It's no issue at all to drop off a couple. Go check out Sun Island. Last stop of the day. I just gotta, just gotta wait until people finish arriving. If you want to give a tour of the island, I'm always always down for for a tour guide.
Oh, it's a sunny day today in Sun Island. Oh, I remember this island. I remember all the gnomes. Remember all the gnomes lined up there at the entrance? It's quite the travel. As I arrived, somebody quietly left. Oh, I guess that's why it took a while to load. Cause someone disconnected. I decided to say, oh, oh. It was okay if you wanted to get a get an island tour. Jotaro, the animal artist from Stardust. Yeah, I'm sure Wolf can still come to streams. There's nothing, nothing really stopping them. All right, we're all here. Nice. Get all your colorful gnomes. Actually, I, I like this island though. Oh, you have like an interesting like diagonal bridge. Huh. Oh, and you have Audi. That's one character actually I would, wouldn't mind switching uh, Julia for if I could. Oh, a visitor. Your name is Blend. It is so nice to meet you. I'm Audi BT Dubs. Legit great change of pace meeting someone from another island. Everybody here is from here. <laughs>
Oh, and you have a Godzilla. If you want a really good psychic Pokemon, definitely go with Alexam. They're supposedly one of the top like competitive Pokemon right now. You got a, little, a nice little sports corner here. Ginormous teddy bear. Yeah, I like that diagonal part there, honestly. I haven't really seen too many people that have done that. Cool little shop here, or a little diner. I don't have the dog nose on me, but I do have the dog nose that I can order. Oh, you have like a little. Oh, this is like a drive in theater. Huh. That's actually kind of neat. seen you around, so I'm guessing you're here visiting Shazam. That's great. Your name's Blend. I hope I pronounced that right. And you've got at least one friend from Sun Island. Ah, oh, I've never seen that bug before that I scared off. I've seen it, I've never caught it. You got lucky. Hey, are you the one visiting from far away or Blend, yeah? I knew it. When I first saw you, I said, I don't know that person. I thought maybe you were a spy or something, but what would you be spying on? I don't know. And I remember hearing we have a visitor who is definitely not a spy. Anyway, I'm lucky. Welcome to Sun Island. Enjoy your non-spying stay. Go check out your house. Oh, you have a bunch of gold roses there. Nice.
Oh, you have a bug, a bug wall, huh? You have the privacy screens. <laughs> Although it's like I can, I can still see you through this, through this privacy screen. <laughs> Oh, and you have the bug things you put on there. <laughs> hey, Robert. Yeah, this is actually a nice, a nice house here. Got like a carrot cake there in the corner. Teeny tiny little peak. There's an outfit called Ninja. <laughs> oh, and in the, in the fridge he has an outfit called Captain. All your keys in case you need to get in somewhere. It's always neat seeing how people set up their house. Oh, and you have like a changing room here. Some more trophies, or is, I guess it's like the study, like a study room. Downstairs and upstairs. <laughs> I love the word neat. Just so neat. Oh, you have like an arcade or like a game studio. That's actually kind of cool. Oh, where did you get this poster? I've never seen that uh, that poster before. With like a Hello Kitty? Isabel. Huh. And you have like KK. Yeah, I've never seen those posters before. Oh, the gold luchador. Huh. Yeah, I like this room. Oh, and you have a picture of Lucky framed? <laughs> That's something I've never seen before either. There's a message written in small letters on the back of the photograph. 
Born November 4th, Scorpio. Favorite saying is, don't bite the hand that feeds you. Currently, this is actually the last last place I'm uh, I'm visiting today. It's the only place, the only other. Actually, I did visit a Southern Hemisphere island today as well, which was kind of neat. We had our island open for the beginning of the stream, and then yeah, we went to do some Southern Hemisphere hunting, which was kind of neat. Oh, they're talking about the code for trading. Yeah. There's always new items I see. Alright, typically I always end my stream at around 11, but today we decided to do some visiting of Williams Island. And yeah, so this is, this is where we're going to end the stream. Just head back to our, to our place first. Island though, it's definitely it's definitely a few changes since the last time I've been here. Oh, right on board. Oh, I'm ready. Ready in the process. Alright, let's go right on the board. Let's see. Typically what I always do, or what I have been doing, let's see, make that big. Uh, let's go with this. Let's do small. Fun and look and dry.
All right, cool. We made a post. Yeah, tomorrow is Mario Maker. So we're going to do Hollow Knights on Friday, Saturday. So I figure we need we need 2 days, 2 days to do like playthroughs of games otherwise. Otherwise the games just won't be beat, right? But yeah, we finished the second boss of Hollow Knight, which I'm pretty glad for. So we have the dash move now when we come back. Yeah, I'm happy with the Mario Maker streams that we actually have uh, Nightbot working properly for the level uploads. Cause yeah, that took a little bit of time to figure figure out that process. Cause whenever you look online for anything like that, it's always uh, always points you to Warp World, which only works with Twitch. It's always neat coming back to your own island though. Alright. That was a that was a good day. As always, if you enjoy the content, remember to leave a like and subscribe. Hopefully you guys and gals have a good rest of your evening, morning, night, whatever, whatever time it is for you. Otherwise, until next time.